A new pilot program is giving people an inside look at how the TVA generates hydroelectric power. News Channel 9's Brandon Evans got to tour the Chickamauga Dam today. He tells us why TVA is opening its doors and how big of an operation this all is. As the TVA celebrates its 85th year, they're now opening up public tours of the Chickamauga Dam for the first time since 9-11. Abigail Sachs is an associate professor at the University of Tennessee and quite the TVA dam enthusiast. I've been waiting for these tours to start. I'm so excited. Around a dozen people toured the Chickamauga Dam today as part of the Built for the People Tour pilot program. Plant manager Robert Chapman says they want to share the TVA's history with the people they serve. This really gives people an opportunity to come inside the dam and view this resource that we have here and to tell the story of how TVA came to be. So how much water flows through these massive generators today? We have four generating units here, so with all of those online, that's going to be about 300,000 gallons per second. A lot of water with a big purpose. Right now we're running uh, full throttle, you might say, so we are at about 142 megawatts, which provides power for about 150,000 people. The sheer size of the plant was eye-opening for Braden, who was touring the plant with his family. From the outside view, I mean, it's pretty big, but looking on the inside and how tall and wide it is from the inside, it's pretty cool. Officials say if these pilot tours go well, they'll continue opening up more of their facilities for more tours in the future. I'm Brennan Evans, News Channel 9. TVA began back in 1933 and serves seven states. Another school shooting this 